Creek. And a tonight, I'm just going to go through um, some really quick, easy ways to do um, some wreaths. Say if you want to do a girls' night um, at your house, you know, have some wine or whatever and have some of your girlfriends over. I'm going to show you a really easy couple of wreaths you can use with a... Uh, Without having to order deco mesh and all that stuff. And most of the items I'm going to be using come from the dollar store. But you would never be able to tell that. I would hope. I don't think so. Anyways, I'll show you in one second. One of them that I made. And I did this yesterday. And the nice thing about these ones that I did do. Put your head up and look. Sorry, I need my glasses. I can actually see now. I'm going to show you guys what I worked on yesterday. Um, it only took me not even 20 minutes to make. And that was like start to finish putting zip ties in and everything. So it would be a really good one. And I think I added up all the costs of, to make it. And the cost was around $12 uh, for all the stuff. That's including paying full price for the, the character board. So this is what I came up with. It's really, really cute. Okay, this is my Santa. And it actually looks like real hair. Right? Obviously, it's not real hair. <laughs> um, I used a feather boa. Oh, God. What? Nothing. I'm just trying to do this. Thing. Oh. Uh, I used two feather boas from the Dollar Tree. Um, these little ruffle things down here I'm are... all over the place. What? Sorry, guys. I'm all over the place with the camera. Oh. There we go. Um, this ruffle stuff is just um, a 9 in or 6 inch ribbon. And you could even use deco mesh down here. This hat is from the Dollar Tree. And I stuffed it with just some pillow stuffing. Um, this little bell that I put on the hat came in a pack of like 8 from the Dollar Store. So if you had a bunch of friends doing Santa, um, you could all just split one pack of the little bells. And, um, and of course, the center and our board. Okay. This one, I didn't put lights or anything in. I just kept it really simple. Oh, and this little thing I used as like a button. It is also from the dollar store. And they're just these. So they come in a six pack. This whole thing, it is so cute. Do you guys not agree? It was so easy to make. Mrs. Claus to go with Santa. So I'm going to do Mrs. Claus almost the same as Santa. So they match. Um, was the Mrs. Claus's hat. Now I ordered the hat on Amazon. They came in like a bag of six. So if you're thinking you want to do um, Mrs. Claus's or Santa's uh, for a girls night or, you know, even a church get together or whatever. These are a fabulous idea because it's not hard, there's not a lot of supplies, and it, you can pretty much get it anywhere. Um, these I got on Amazon in a six pack. Um, and so these ones are. Around so much. Huh? Yeah, oh, just, oh. Oh. So I uh, pre bought these, but I did show um, on a tutorial how to make your own um, bonnets for Mrs. Claus. So if you do have friends and you can't get them on Amazon or whatever, you can make your own. They're really, really easy. But I cheated tonight and I got these. And they're not expensive at all. So, um, But I'm just going to put this aside because I am going to work. Did it the same way except we only went... I stopped the feathers right here and right here. Now I had zip tied these ruffles onto the board. And then I took them off because I was going to try something else. And I thought, ah, oh, screw it. I'm going to put them back on. Then I just hot glued them. But for Mrs. Claus, I'm going to show you guys how to put it right on the board. But I stopped his stuff here. Now for Mrs. Claus, I'll probably stop at these set of three holes and do the rest of this um, with where did, red. Where did you get his hat? Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree. I thought you said dollar. You didn't get yeah. Dollar. No, this one I got at Dollar Tree. Oh. I got it today. And I stuffed it. I have a, you guys all know, I have a pillow that I've opened. It's almost dead. And I used the stuffing out of it. And I don't have very much left. But I stuffed the hat, and then I blew it shut. So, we're going to put Snowman away. And we are going to work on... Mrs. Claus. Mrs. Claus now. Okay, you got to stop doing the singing thing like Oprah. Uh, I, you're 
Bossy Pants. I need a drink. Okay, I'm the suckiest Bod Podger. So, those of you that got them decoupaged from me. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> you probably should have did it yourself. <laughs> no, I'm not that bad. I'm bad, I'm not that bad. <laughs> okay, I'm not the best decoupager either. I'm not the best wreather. I'm not the best decoupager. Oh. All right. We are going to do the same thing with Mrs. Claus's hair. We're going to go around number two. So it does say on here, ooh, itchy. This is circumference one, circumference two. It actually says it on the board. Now, I wanted to add a little pizzazz to Mrs. Claus's hair because anytime I, she usually, well, she usually has it pulled back and everything, but for this one, I wanted to make it look like she had a little bit of curly hair. And I'm going to show you how I am going to do that. So I'm going to take my feather boas. I think she's always got it pulled back. Uh, well, usually in pictures, she has it pulled back. Oh, this is a different one. It came from the Dollar Tree, too. It's got a different tag on it, but it's still from the Dollar Tree. It says, Just Pretending Dress Up. Hi, Debbie. Okay. I'm going to cut the end off again. This big old knot. I'm not going to put lights in her, because I didn't put lights in Santa. So, I'll probably sell it or donated or I'm still thinking what I'm going to do. I want to do like a an auction on my wreaths and see how much money I can raise to give it to the Dream Center, which is uh, where my office is. It's uh, my office and <coughs> warehouse is in a building called the Dream Center and they do amazing stuff for homeless people. <clears throat> they have a food bank and a thrift store and everything in the building. So I'm thinking I want to do something for them. But anyways, for um, the inside of these, I have the this deco tubing I got. You guys have seen me use it before. I can't remember what I used it for. But it's got like snowball around it. We used it for uh, for our centerpieces. Oh, the centerpieces. That's right. Because remember, I kept yeah. getting confused. Yeah. So, but you can use any deco tubing, like white, and just to give, you know, the, you can leave it just with feathers, you know. Or you can cut pieces. Now I cut these at 14 inches. And what I'm going to do. Please zoom in. Okay, I'll do my best. Zoom in. So I went, I'm leaving one, two, three, four, five holes down here exposed. This is my middle. Okay, and this is my hanging hole. Now her head is a little bit to the side. She's looking cockeyed. So. She's not off center, she's just looking to the side. I'm gonna put my hanging string in before I have to dig through all this feather. Now, don't you think your friends would have a great time? Especially if you get the wine out and some munchies. Oh, can you imagine what you get when you put the wine out? And rum and eggnog. Oh yeah, well, you would do this before the drinking really commenced. <laughs> Because who knows what you would have afterwards. But they would have something fun to go home with. Okay, now if you're, like I said, if you're not dealing with really good crafters, stick with just the boa. Make her hair just boa. But I'm going to go extra because I'm extra. There's the end of my rope. So I am going to just zip this. But I'm not going to zip it tight because I have this 14-inch piece. And I'm going to put like looking like curls in her hair so I'm just folding it over on each other so you just want to fold it kind of in half just like that so the two ends kind of overlap on each other and then you can take the center of that and push it down so I've got you right zoomed in so you can just show them do it right over top of the board so okay okay yes boss just telling you yes boss Boss, I am the producer though. Oh, okay. Remember, no, I, remember that's what I, I don't want it looking like a, too much like a bow. I want it looking more like curls. So I'm going to keep the ends outside. Get the bud light out. She's got it out there. Oh, I got Coors light. Not the bud. She's got Coors. Coors. And nice and tight. Okay. Snip this off. 
Now we are going to go around three on the outside. So this will kind of get covered and it will get all pushed up. And it just gives a little bit of dimension to Mrs. Claus's hair. And it's fun. It's fun. And like I said, they have they have deco tubing that you can buy. Just the iridescent stuff at the dollar store. At Dollar Tree. You can use that. I just happen to have this in my tickle closet. Tickle trunk. I know, it's the tickle closet though. <laughs> That's just wrong. Why is it wrong? Because you make it take it from a beloved kids show to <laughs> Well you Silence you're the lambs or something. <laughs> Silence <laughs> the tickle closet. Come into my tickle closet. It could have been fifty shades of grey. <laughs> Don't spit your pop out. <laughs> Well, I have all kinds of little doohickey things in my tickle closet. <laughs> really? That's just wrong. Uh, especially if it's on sale, man. I have to scoop it. You never know. I'm, I use that. I put that stuff in everything. <laughs> Where is this conversation I go? have no clue. This is really getting bad now. Oh, Lord. We got the first Oh, Lord. Oh, we got an Oh, Lord. Tanya or Michelle? Michelle. Dee -dee -dee -dee. Jan got interrupted and she's back because she just. Hi, got Jan! Off. Jan did a nice wreath today. Did you see Mrs. Monkey? I could not believe that. I Googling something, looking for an image. I don't even remember what I was Googling. I Googled happy oh. wreathing or wreathing friends or something. So I do recent French, click on images, and there's Michelle Monkey Creation right up on the featured bar. You ain't rate none of you. <laughs> it's like, how does she rate? How come I'm not on the how come I'm not on the feature bar? I wasn't even on the first page. Hmm. Jan said none of us are right. Yeah, no. But uh, you guys are really getting out there, like I said. Just searching an image, and I seen Nancy James was on the first page. Michelle was on page twice. It was really cool. I'm special. Who's special? Michelle. Oh, she's special, all right. Yeah, we're going to leave that one alone. <laughs> we ain't saying a word. I don't know what it is. It's some kind of algorithm or something. And maybe people have liked your page or... I know Tanya tweets about everything, so I don't know if it was a Twitter thing or... I don't know, I was just so impressed that... <laughs> it's like, holy cow! I was like, I know those wreaths! Wait a second! See? It's because I'm not the greatest wreather. I'm a sucky wreather. Yeah, you're a sucky wreather. I'm a sucky wreather. Oh, isn't this special? Look how special she is. So when her hat goes on, we'll push her curls down. Do you just fart? Why do you say that all the time? Why do you fart while I'm doing lives? Well, why do you have to tell everybody that I fart? Because in case I choke and die, at least they know what from. <laughs> they don't stink. It's not like roses. We just we just lost how many viewers? <laughs> how many viewers, hon? Oh, quite a few. <laughs> They're all running over to Scott. What's Scott making? Did you go over and check out? I don't know. He's on Mesh Man or something. Oh, Scott's on Mesh Man? Is this Mrs. Claus available to buy the download? No. This is a print that I purchased the license for. And unfortunately, I cannot sell it as a digital print. But I can sell it on the frame as a sign. So, that's what I do. I love di digital designing. I could make one of these, like, well, a lot of the digital centers that I have, I've made. I just haven't had time, so. Maybe on our slow period. Do you guys find January and February, like, really slow? I know when I was doing wreathing, I pretty much did not want to look at another wreath by the end of, by Christmas finished. So we're trying to figure out what, uh, what's going to happen in January and February. I have a to-do goal list I want to do in January and February, which is get through all my my 
what are they, um, coach groups, I'm in a few coaching groups and stuff, and, um, I think I've done, like, one module, so I'd really like to get through some of those, um, I want to design some more digitals, what's that? He's doing a wreath from the wreath kit that he's Oh, out. that's what a lot of people are probably... Time for a vacation. Well, we are going on vacation in February. We, we are. We if the lawyers and everything would stop taking all our money, we could be. <laughs> Sucks. I, I, I still want to get my craft site going. Oh, God. Dave's doing a craft site. There's little things I really want to do. I want to learn a whole bunch of, about social media. Don't Tanya knows everything, but I know really absolutely nothing. Don't put me down about my craft I'm site. not putting you down. You do whatever you want, honey. Should I tell them about when I sent you out for a vacuum cleaner to Canadian Tire and you come home with a Michael's bag and all happy about your ribbons? I oh, wait, I just told them. <laughs> do you have any digital downloads for Valentine's Day? Listen, I made a beautiful bow today. You know, you did, I did make a beautiful bow. It's huge. It's ginormous. It has to go on the most ginormous wreath available. But you need to make a hockey player. You need to make. A, oh, I need to do a whole bunch. All that we had Easter and Valentine's Day. Oh yeah, Easter. I'm not worried. Like, come March, see when we branched out in. Um, we came out in the end of April. So we totally missed the whole flower festivals and all that stuff. Oh, yeah, we'll have lots of stuff for spring. And yeah. So we know it's going to be really big for flowers because um, that even last year, just when we came out at that time, uh, we were doing really well. And that was in May. But like the row, most of the rose festivals and daffodil festivals and stuff like that, they're in May, March and April, and we missed it. The big state of Texas. We missed it, so we are not missing it this year. So that, we already know. I sent way more flower boards to Amazon than I did character boards because of that reason. Because I know once March hits, March, we, March 1st, everybody will be making sunflowers. Where can I get that face, please, if you can? You have to order it on our web page, but you have to um, have us put it on for you. And how about images for baby shower wreath? Yeah, we could do that. Oh, there's all kinds of stuff. Like I said, we're only, well, what are we on now? Seven months on now? I don't know. I think we're seven or eight months now. Well, we started at the end of April. So, there's a lot we can still do. But there's also only a bar so much. Scene for a wreath. A what? Bar scene. Oh, like bar, like drinking bar. Yeah, I guess. Oh. I love doing like sports ones, you know, but we can't sell those. However, if you ever wanted one, you could just message me. I'm known to give a free thing out here and there. <laughs> I guess I shouldn't have said that. Yeah, there's lots of stuff. We just have to find time. I have no time to do nothing right now. Hold on. Don't know. I don't know why, but can't find the giveaway blue sign up. Can't find the giveaway blue sign up button on your website to sign up on. Unless you may already be signed up, maybe. I don't know. Um. If you send a message, a PM or an email, um, our admin team will uh, get on that because I have no idea how to work anything. They do all that, mainly Tanya, the guru. She is the guru. So she can help you. She tells me what to do. Face. Is it one of yours? Only on the board. Isn't that what you said? Yeah. I can't remember. It the the ladies page is on Etsy. You can buy her. I think it's Happy Frogs or something. Yeah, I think that's what it's called. But you'll have to know how to size it and all that stuff. 
because you can buy the digital image, but you're going to have to know what how to do it. And I'm not going to offer that, like, if you buy the image from her, sizing it and everything. Um, I, there, I just don't have time for that. So, I believe she's from Romania or who knows, but you can message her. Not the friendliest, but... What's this blue button we're talking about? Uh, something with a giveaway. Tanya's doing a giveaway on the website, I think. I think if you sign up for the newsletter, uh, I think Tanya's got a few giveaways I going. Stuff off you so you do have my email, so maybe that's why. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what this blue button is. Now I gotta go look and see because I'm curious. I don't even know. What's I think on she posted page. a giveaway too on our Facebook page. I, I don't even know what's on our site. On our site. Neither do I. Where would it be? What? Blue button. Well, that's what she's asking. I think it's a newsletter if you s sign up really for our email. Oh, All right, so we're coming to my last one here. There's a blue button to sign up. You give me your email. Yeah, that might be the one. I don't know. Tanya just posted it today. Okay, so we have leftovers, so we're going to come around and keep going around the other way. So I'm going to go through this hole. Okay, that's what people are saying. It's the top left. Yeah, okay, I did the sign up. For okay, time. so I'm going to go through this hole, and I'm going to go around the outside, but I'm coming back for my third pass. So like I said, you don't have to add anything. I just thought the little curlies were kind of cute. Try not to get the feather in this zip tie. Now, don't pull your zip tie tight when you hit the board. And I just jammed up my zip tie because of the feathers. I will cut that. Well then entertain them. <laughs> big, big man on campus with the app. Now you can see why you don't use, you only use two boas for Mr., uh, for Santa and Mrs. Claus. Um, and then the, uh, the snowman is two and a half because we had to go all the way around. Is that a boa? It is a feather boa. It's a feather boa, did you know? Ah! Uh -huh. You see how he did that? Made a rhyme? Uh-huh. Where's my app for laughing? Never mind, I don't want it. You're, oh, hold on. Hold on, we'll do... I don't know where my little nippers are. Excuse me, what did you say? My nippers. Oh. What do you think I said? Never mind, I don't want to know what you thought I said. <laughs> it started with nip. <laughs> Nipples? Hey! Why? I was just guessing. Don't say anything. There goes all the people again. Well, they better get used to it. They Most of them know us now. Oh, Anyways. man, I think the dog farted. Babe. I mean... Oh. She does not do that. Oh, she tooted. No, she doesn't. She did dog tooties. Only Duchess does. Lady, oh. Lady's too much of a lady. Okay, you, of course I you need... always use... One. Six and a half inch zip ties? No, I use eight inch. I usually use six and a half or eight inch, whatever I have on hand. Okay, so I have, whew, I just need a little piece of boa. Ba -wa. Lady, you are no lady tonight. Cool. Let's see, I got this one to do, this one to do, and this one to do, and this little piece will be perfect. Need a hardy insert. The only problem with you that can't, is that you can get into trademarks. Yeah. I could do a motorcycle. You could do black and orange or something like yeah, that. Yeah, but you can't around. say Harley. Yeah. 
fit in big doo doo. Okay, keep moving your thing around. Can you hold it in one spot so I don't have to keep moving the camera around? What are you talking about? Because every time I move, every time. Uh, I'm making a wreath. What do you expect? I'm to trying to not follow, move? Listen, being cameraman's not an easy job. You have a Mevo. What more do you need? Well. So you guys can't even see the zip ties. It just kind of all blends. Because you keep moving the board all around. No, that, no, it's because it all blends. Because it's boring. It's so easy. You're not really learning anything. You're losing viewers because the dog's tooting. No, because you do stupid app. Where is my stupid ass over there? Okay, last one. Yeah, you can use a gift bag as a... Yeah, you can use it. I've, I've used... Uh, you can do anything you want yourself. It's just, yeah, we can't, you can't sell. You can't sell it, even you. If you go out and... I'm sure if you sold one wreath with a Harley... Oh, yeah, I, I've sold, sold Harley ones. I've sold Mickey ones, like on buy and sell pages, but... I wouldn't recommend putting it on Etsy or anything. Yeah, but as, we a, business, definitely get... but as a business, we couldn't really yeah. go and try selling it. No. Nope, nope. There we go. I don't know what these purple things are for. These actually look like curlers or something in her hair. <laughs> okay, so down below, I'm going to do red. And I'm going to use, I'm going to do it almost similar to Santa, I think. No, maybe, I'm going to use the same ribbon, but let's see. What is the ruffle around the face? Oh, it's just deco tubing. I kind of made it look like she's got curls in her hair. Because we're going to put her, where's her hat? We're going to put her hat on. I'm hoping to push this kind of forward so you can see her little curls coming out. And then this is going to be all red. Oh my gosh, she's got me so cute! Now, I can't remember how big I cut these. Let's start with 12 inch. 12 inch is always a good size. Really? You're the one who keeps saying it. I never said nothing, but it's just the way you say it. I know you. You don't know me nothing. I know you. What makes a little... Is that going to be enough? It might be enough for the outside. So I'm going to do these two outsides. Are you uh, innovating there again? Yep. This is how I roll. Did you make that? Hat? Did you make the Mrs. Claus hat this time? No, I didn't. I bought it on Amazon. Came in like a six pack. Oh, but, look how cute! But yeah, she did make them before. Yes, I did make them. Make made them. I have made made them. So there is a tutorial on our YouTube channel. And I did just finally. I forgot to post. I usually post the videos, uh, the Facebook lives onto our YouTube channel after I'm done them. Oh, hello, Anita. She's been doing laundry. Forgot we y'all were coming on. Y'all! Oh, you sweet thing. You're so precious. We're just making some fun wreaths that are easy to make. So if you have non-crafty friends, I have a lot of non-crafty friends. They can become crafty and they have that. I made that. Because even though this is simple as anything, if they made it, they'll still be happy as anything. No, we should do it. Because it'll be actually resemble a wreath. <laughs> That'll just make them happy. We should zip tie the dog to the wreath frame. What's wrong with you? <laughs> zip tie the eights to it and then just... There's something wrong with you. Okay. So these ones, I think I'm going to do what 15 length? inches because I want it bigger than... What length did you say? 12 inches. Yeah, I did, did these outside ones 12 inches. And this is like a 5 and a half inches ribbon. 
I bought I bought this stuff too. Anybody know how to use it? <laughs> Where's that bag? This crazy stuff at the dollar Lori, store. Get a sign for yourself. Let's just assume I'm right and save us both a lot of time. Yeah. No. I bought this stuff. It's this curly stuff. I thought, oh, that's really cool. Yeah. Anybody ever work with this stuff? Like, what the heck do you do with it? I think it's meant to be streamers, like. No, it was in the ribbon aisle at the dollar store. Stop. It's called metallic ribbon. I don't know. I was scrunching it. It's pretty. It makes this weird Play around shape. With it. I'm trying to figure oh, I was playing it. around with it, and it was getting me frustrated. What is the? It's a boa. It's a boa with some deco tubing. Deco snowball deco tubing to make it similar to. So I'm going to cut this. Actually, I'm going to cut it 16 inches. And I need four. One. Why are you cutting that six inches? Sixteen. Oh, why are you cutting that sixteen? Because I want to make a big ruffle okay. around her bottom. It's different, Jan says. Well, yes, it is different. Jan. What? My ribbon or the, the ribbon? I know, and I don't know how to work it. I was playing with it for like an hour. It's like I then I got frustrated. It's like, what the hell is this crap? I'll use it as, as my tree tails. As tree tails? Yeah. Really? How do you use it though? It just keeps curling. You like you cut it in pieces, or do you actually? Wow! What? Nita. What's that? She sold eight UITC wreaths this weekend. Oh my God! Sold. Good for her. Wow! Everybody's been selling them like crazy. Congrats! I think it's just because you know what people like the different. Everybody's got pretty much the same stuff. You know, grapevine wreaths and. Oh, Dana, Lori's put that behind her. She's worried more about the rash on her face. <laughs> Thanks, babe. Yeah, no problem. She's not losing no sleep over it. Oh, God, no. It's long gone. And it wasn't what happened. It was the viewers that I've seen watching not saying anything. That's what really it hurt my feelings. It goes in between the round metal frames. What? The, the squishy stuff. And the other one, and then Michelle says it drapes down my nine foot tree. Nine foot tree? Really, Michelle? She got Michelle, money. Michelle's got a nine foot tree. And she got money. Oh, I well, see, that didn't work. I see the hilarious thing. That, um, hilarious? Hilarious. Hilarious. They put the tree up so it sits in the window and it goes up to the ceiling, but then. I only have sucky zip ties left. And then outside they put another little tree on top of the roof so it looks like the tree goes right up through the roof. When did we see that? It was funny in a picture. Or was it funny when the dog said it? Okay. Michelle says I'm extra. She is extra. Do you see the size of her friggin' wreaths? Good God! So, I only. I didn't bring enough zip ties home from the warehouse. So I'm using crappy zip ties from Dollar Tree, and if you pull them sometimes, they snap. So if you're making a wreath for somebody to purchase, please don't use Dollar Tree zip ties. They deteriorate, and they will... You can say deteriorate, but you can't say rotary. It's rotary. Yeah. Okay. 11 foot tree. Wow. Dana. Dana Downs. 11 foot tree. I have no clue what I was thinking. That's mass. That's like my brother's trees. That's, that's, he had a crane bring a tree in. That's Christmas vacation type of tree. Yeah. Squirrel! I like my little white Christmas tree. Well, it's not really little. It's six feet. Kathy made his Christmas tree and gave it to her beautician today. She hung Ooh. it up in the shop. Very nice. Oh, that's Everyone cool. Everyone loved it. Very cool. Yeah, everybody's doing quite well. I can't wait till the spring, though. I really can't. Like, the flowers are going to be... And Dave's got an idea. Great. And Dave's not saying nothing about it because I'm not going to get... He tells me ideas and I squash it. I squash his dreams. Yeah. And his ambitions. Babe, sometimes it's just like, what the heck? That's not true. Just because you live with a... A crafter it doesn't make you a crafter, but Listen. you can try. I'm not gonna burst your bubble because I love you and I support you. 
and you're you're the, my everything. What are you talking about? I don't know. I I'm I, mumbling on you. I've here. got good. I'm trying because I'm reading comments. My boyfriend's so mad at me. I use all his zip ties. He. <laughs> Carrie's try selling trying to sell her wreaths for thirty five forty dollars, but she can't sell any in the Welland area. Really? Carrie Tillman? Yeah. We have a humongous tree at church. We have to stand on a tall ladder to decorate it. Carrie, why are you selling them in Welland? Um. Welland's anyway, not... I've got a great. I've got a great <laughs> spring wreath that's gonna blow everyone away. <laughs> <laughs> are you going to share it with us? No, in the spring I will. When I make it. Are you making a new flower? It, it, it's going to go. It's going to go together with my with my crafting channel. Oh Because I'm going to do the crafts on the crafting channel, and I'm going to attach them. To Have you guys hands. looked at our Pinterest page? Dave has done every single thing on that Pinterest page all by himself. By the way, some of you that send in your wreaths. I have been using your wreaths on the Pinterest page, and then and then I um, send them off to your uh, Facebook page. Yeah, so if you go on our Pinterest and you see your picture, if you click on your picture, that picture is going to take you to your Facebook page. So if strangers pick on, um, click on one of Monkey Creations' pictures, it's going to take them right to Monkey Creations' Facebook page. So it's How work, cool is that, eh? It's a work in progress, so yeah. when you guys share them, and I, I, I'll one more. put them in there and uh, I send them off to your page. So One more. Yeah, he's doing really good. Like, so, all the pins he's done, he's made himself. Which I is way more than I can do. I couldn't figure Pinterest out if it saved me. I love Pinterest, but I just... I've been to five shows so far. And Emery sells maybe one or two. That's it. It's well in Carrie. <laughs> Is that Carrie talking? Yeah. It's well in. You sell the boards to face it. Some, some of them, not all of them, uh, Patty. You can go to our site, which is pinned at the bottom, and you can see which ones we sell. With. Apparently, some of them are sold out, like um, Festivus Sourpuss and Santa and everything. So I will have a look. When I'm finished this live, oh, why do I keep putting these in backwards? What the heck? So I know a few people that are making them here, and they sell them. Not a problem. Um, Niagara area is good to sell them, but Welland, I'm not too sure. Yeah. Not too sure about Welland. Gotta kind of look around and see. Because Burlington, you gotta go. Well, there's not a lot of money in Welland. <coughs> That's true. And, yeah, there goes, you know. There goes all our well and viewers. <laughs> you know, you'll have better luck selling in Burlington and Oakville, where there's actual, where there's money. All right. We looking good. Sorry, guys. This is what it took a lot. I could have been done by now if I wasn't Gavin. All right. So she's done. I want her to match Santa. Now Santa, I put uh, just one of these snowflakes as a button. And for Mrs. Claus, I think I'm going to do a few snowflakes around the bottom. <coughs> and these are the snowflakes. They're just from the dollar store, so you get a pack of six. Not a lot of money in Hagersville either. No, not a lot of money in Hagersville. <laughs> Yeah, it's unfortunately, you have to. A lot of people in Hagerstown. <laughs> yeah, you really have to know your market. Okay, so one, two, three. I like I'm to work with. And Jan says I'm having a hard time selling here too, but I'm not giving up. That's right, Jen. You don't, don't give, give up. up. Just, I'm going to do five. Don't keep trying to do the same thing over and over. Yeah. That's all. Nobody says easy, but if you enjoy it, yeah, it might be worth it. Even if you make your supplies back or whatever. Sometimes that's what I would do. You know, if I had some wreaths left over, it's like, ah, as long as I make my supplies back, because I enjoy doing it. Okay, I'm just going to hot glue these on. 
So if you're doing this with your friends and you have the non-crafty crafter, you, you may like want to, to do the... Would you guys like to buy a wreath there really nice? Good one, Carrie. What'd she say? <laughs> Would you guys like to buy a wreath there really nice? <laughs> I have walls and walls of them, Carrie. I don't know what I'm doing with them. The Grinch sold fast at 45. I know you did well at the, um, you, she did well at a craft sale. I know she had, went to a craft sale. But Alice said the Grinch sold fast at 45. Yeah. You mean Festivus Sourpuss. Festivus Sourpuss. So I'm going to put one here, one here. Yes, that's right, Jan. What's that? The definition of sanity, doing the same thing over and over, expecting a different result. Yeah, you just kind of have to know your market, and yeah, you gotta try if you have things. an Etsy store, you may have more chance. Uh, it's just so much competition out there. I but. have a class on Sunday and one on Tuesday with Margie. Oh, good Margie. Margie's rocking it with the classes, boy. Yeah, I know. And they turn out fantastic. Like, you must be really teaching them well because they are so good. Although, look who she got for a teacher. Oh, please. Come on. Please. I think I'll just leave three snowflakes. Yeah. Mer. 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 Not even, she, she'll match Santa's. I just put one of these in ruffles in there. Okay, that's good enough. No, I gotta put her hat on. Classes are always great. They're the best. You don't yeah. have to make them yourself. Yeah, you don't have to make them yourself. And they take it home. You don't have to store it either. Forty-five percent uh, in Mrs. Claus and fifty dollars for snowman or cardinal leaf. That's good prices, actually. That's be for her classes. That's for her classes. Yeah, but people will pay that not only because they get a wreath, but because they're gonna go out and have a good time with their friends and you know that's the same with like having something to you know at your home oh you gave margie the courage to do the classes oh good i'm so glad now i'm going to take a closed couple clothes pins because i know i'll burn myself i just stuffed this hat and this hat i just got from amazon i think it was a pack of six it's kind of cute now i have made my own you guys have seen that before but i'm cheating so if you're going to make these and somebody wants to make Mrs. Claus, you can cheat too. Although, like I said, it isn't hard to make. So I put stuffing in it. Oh, wow. And I, other wreath, the wreath designers taking classes, Margie does. Wow. You can start a chapter, Margie. I had people coming from all over Ontario, didn't I? Yeah, you did. I did. I had people coming from, like, driving for two hours just to come to a, a class. That kind of blew me away. But it took it. You know, it took a good three years to get that, um, to get that, what's it called? Like, where, you know, people were actually waiting for me to post the things, to, yeah. and it sold out so fast. Um, what's it called? Reputation. Reputation, that's it, yes. So you build a reputation, and it took me about three years. You know, I started out with two, two people at Michael's, and then it went up to maybe four, you know, then I started selling out Michael's, which was only like 10 people. You want fame? Start painting <sighs> here in sweat. So it's not an overnight thing. But if you stick to it and people like you and they have fun, they're going to tell their friends. And they're telling their friends, yeah. and it's seriously, it's a they snowball want, effect. They want to learn boards. I tell them I'll give them the link, but they want to see a person doing them. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. Oh, yeah. And there's tons of people out there um, that don't want to make their own wreaths. They want, you know, a Mrs. Claus, but they don't want to make it. I've had a few, quite a few people message me, and I, I send them to unique wreath makers to go find people so if you're not on your unique wreath makers and workshops make sure you get on there and post uh where you're from and if you're selling wreaths and work or, or doing workshops or do both because i send people over there if they're looking 
you know, if they're looking for somebody in Georgia, they can just search Georgia in there and find uh, somebody that's making them or having a workshop. Okay, so I just glued the inside. No, I'll just finish gluing it. You can stitch these if you want. I'm too lazy. Yeah, I know those mad. You know what? I have the same problem at doing things with the the thing mo e emotion. What do you call them? Emoticons. Oh whatever. yeah, you put your fat fingers. My fat fingers sometimes hit the angry faces. He gets the angry faces. About some of the angry faces. Yeah, I know people hit them be by accident because. Well, they're so close together. I know. All right. Let's put her hat on and get it, this thing I, I read a thing on, on a meme, and it's funny because it's true. When you look at the emoticons, you start from the left, and it's the stages of a relationship. <laughs> you got the thumbs up, you got the hearts, you got the laughter, you got the shock, then you got the tears, and then you got the anger. Angry. All right, so this is my middle. Do I want her hat? I, well, I got Santa's. Oh, look, guys. Look, look. Oh, my gosh. I got to turn this around because this is so cute. Matching. Oh, gee. There you went again. Woohoo. <laughs> oh, and I found this. Oh, my gosh, guys. Look at this. I was going to put this on Santa. It's it's a tie, and it's the god awfulest tie, and I was going to put it on Santa, and he was just too cute to, to gaudy him up, so I didn't do it. All right, so I might just glue her hat on. I don't feel like putting zip ties and everything. So I'm gonna, there's the center. I'm just gonna find the center of her hat, which would probably be the oh. berries here. Kind of push this down. I have my deep boards up here now. I can't think of so I can play. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna put her little curl things kind of going forward. And I'm just gluing her hat on. That would be cute on Duchess to tie. Okay, so I'm I'm just globbing glue. I'm using Gorilla Glue you sticks. Only have Mrs. Claus. Huh? Probably oh, is that left? That's left. Oh, I'll put some more on. You have to go check out the sweatshirt. Yeah. Shop. The guys, well, they probably didn't even realize they were sold out either. And sold out means that. I ordered, uh, I don't know how many prints of each, and got them printed in deck, um, Mod Podge them on to frames, and then the warehouse just sends them out. So, although my head warehouse guy, Jay, he's getting, he's, he's going to be, he's quite the good Mod Podger, and he really likes Mod Podging. He finds it therapeutic. <laughs> I do too. All right, that's it. She's done. I just glued her hat on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, her is cute. So this is Mrs. Gee, what time of day is it? Pull it back up to the up there. Can you see? 9.47. Oh, yeah, perfect. Can you guys see? They're matching and they're cute. With their hair. There's Santa. With his flowing locks. That's why I love the feathers. The feathers look, actually look there. And then there's Mrs. So, very, very easy to do. Very inexpensive. Um, I use two feather boas on each of them. Some ruffled six inch mesh on the bottom. Well, it's a, a ribbon. Um, I got it at the dollar store, but you can use mesh if you want. Uh, the only thing that didn't get from the dollar store was this tubing, but you can get just white tubing. I got this on Amazon. Santa's hat, I did get at the Dollar Tree. The bells, I did. put in on Amazon for Mrs. Hat? Um, I think, I, what are they called? Mop, mop bonnet, I think they're called. Or mop hat. Or you can just type in Mrs. Mrs. Claus bonnet, and I think that comes up. Pause and uh, Santa. All right. Just go.